Hey everybody, welcome to ProTrucksPlus.com. This is Justin Mahaffey and today we are checking out a 2003 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. And it's got a ton of cool stuff on it. It's really low miles. I don't recall exactly what they are. <laughs> but we'll check out the odometer. I think it's got like 60,000 miles on it. It's got a, a really cool metallic bronze paint job. I've never actually seen it before on one of these Rubicons. Pretty sweet. But as far as aftermarket stuff goes, we'll check it out. We got worn winch front and back, or uh, excuse me, worn bumpers front and back. So you got a worn bumper with a bully bar, uh, fog lamps here, you got a little pull hook here, and you have with it a 9.5 Ti worn winch, which is really beefy. It's surprisingly large for such a, a small vehicle. So you can pull out Hummers and stuff too when they get stuck, as they do. Ha ha! Rubicons win. You got the Rubicon alloys with brand new BF Goodrich KM2s. Beefy tread on there, so you don't have to worry about those for quite some time. Good looking paint job. Excellent shape all around. Um, and you've got a wilderness rack up top. Nice modular wilderness rack with your uh, high jack. Uh, lifted vehicle rig here, lifted vehicle jack here. Uh, the Jeep itself doesn't look lifted, which is good. It was older, owned by an older gentleman before from up north lack, uh, Northern California. And you've got a rear worn bumper with a tow package and a swing out tire carrier. And this one isn't super complicated like many I've seen. You just pull up the damn thing and pull the rack out. Whereas some of them you gotta like complete a puzzle to get it to open. It's like Jenga or something. Crazy. Okay. And here's your expansive, cavernous, enormous rear boot. Actually the seat goes down right there and it actually comes it comes out completely so you have a lot of storage room in the back of the Wrangler. Surprisingly. But who needs that when you got a badass wilderness rack up top? I mean really? Really really? Check out the rag top, it's in great shape. Um, and the windows, which really is the first thing I look at, is uh, they're not discolored, discolored or fogged or ripped. Uh, no rips or tears in the top anywhere. Got running boards, running bars, right under the rocker panels that come with the Rubicon. Check out the interior. Manual locks and windows, so they don't break. <laughs> as easily as electronic ones anyways. If they even offered them then, I don't recall. Here's your nice rear seat. The cloth is in excellent shape. It's it's not been off-roaded or wheeled hardcore, obviously, because those ones are usually beat to hell. It looks like a nice runner. And you got your locking center console, handbrake there, so when you want to do drifting, you can do that. And you got your five-speed manual, and then your manual transfer case. You got axle lock, which is part of the Rubicon package. Uh, dual power outlets down there. Uh, this is a non-smoker. Uh, you got CD player, factory CD player, AC, which they don't all come with AC, so check that out for you buy. I learned the hard way once. The hot way, rather. All right, let's hop in. Let's just get right in there. Removable doors. It's got some sweet stuff. Uh, you got cruise control, sweet, very cool. Uh, there's your fog lamp and headlamp controls. It's only got 56,000 miles, so I quoted you high. So I guess as far as dealers go, you don't want to overpromise. People have really bad thoughts about us, and I don't think it's totally fair to be honest with you. But that's just me. Anyways, super clean Jeep. I'm not gonna drive it because it's really a pain in the ass to do the video and, and drive these things, the five speeds at the same time. I'm sadly not that talented. Hence the car selling. <laughs> oh God. Getting some deep stuff here, guys. Really deep stuff. Anyways, we got super clean, uh, privately owned. It's not an auction vehicle. 2003 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon with really low miles, 56,000 miles. Uh, they're going to come just as well equipped as the 2006 one, and let's not even talk about the 2007 and after one because, ha 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 ha, that's not a Jeep. Let's get real here, okay? Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed your time with me. My name's Justin, ProTrucksPlus.com. Our phone number is 925-449-4747. Give us a call before you pop in, otherwise you'll be really surprised. Thanks a lot.